Hello YouTube, Jack the Food Guy here, welcome back to a new episode of The Road to Glory. Today, AA have done a madness. We have got our first Serie League player objective milestone. And what you have to do pretty much is score a goal in three separate rival matches with what with what Serie A team that you're trying to complete. Uh, so if you think Juventus, Napoli, Atlanta, Inter Milan, AC Milan, Roma are all sort of the easy teams to get this objective done so you only get two players per which is one rare, a gold and a silver so like it could be a rare silver, it could be a rare gold so those can be good, but they can also be absolute ass. But then it gets better a by a tiny bit. You get two regular player packs, which is good because if you just stock all these up, I mean, for the next promo or something, you could, I mean, stock these up for team of the year if you really want to. But yeah, that Politano looks really good, and that's our first milestone player that uh, EA have released. There are some new SBCs out, but I want to tell you my record in foot jumps. Uh, we're 6-4 and four right now. We've done a lot better than last week. Last week, obviously, we only played 5 games, though. Today I would play 10 games because I just felt like it for some reason. This team is balling to Kure in the so called rude hullet role that Nick 2AT calls it. He's actually really good. He's also a very good DM. And yeah, let's get one of these SBCs done. I'm not going to do the kit SBCs because, in my opinion, they're just not worth it. It doesn't matter what kit kit you wear. It really doesn't. And also, you're going to see here, a certain Mexican player that I've packed, Carlos Fair. Just did a random two regular player pack and uh, packed him. So, we're going to put Pizarro in and I'll put him in. That's a strong link. It doesn't have to be exactly gold, which is nice. Um, now I think we'll just go... Maybe not. Where? It's other thing. Yeah. There's just not enough there. Syria. We've got quite a lot of Syria players. We'll take him, we'll take him, and we'll take Spinozola. So we'll stick him up front. Obviously, these can be used in the Syria objectives, so I'm being quite stupid getting rid of them. Uh, but I do want to bring you some content today. I'm going to show you my marquee matchup packs. And we'll go over them. Okay, uh, done. Okay. We'll get rid of the sheet go. Monday. The other Him 
men, and there we go, guys. That's the team we're putting forward for Dia de Maturitas. I mean, I'm bad at pronunciations. But, uh, right, we'll open this. Premium Electron Players Pack. This is a 12.5k pack, I think. No board. Shocking. My pack look since uh, yes, since Bernardo Silva has been shocking. We'll just stall that. But, but anyway, we're gonna get on our marking matchup packs. And all right then, guys. Uh, we've just got the last two packs of marking matchups, which is uh, the good packs. So premium gold player pack, I whacked that open first. Um, we don't get a board, so we just skip it. Vasquez in there, duplicate Sank Sola. Um, just discard him. And list him up for about that. I think he eventually sold. I don't know if he sold for that price. No board from the Rare Electron players pack either. So, disappointing in my opinion. Very disappointing. Uh, we kept that silver for when the Premier League League SBC comes out because he'll actually shoot up in price in my opinion. We just list these up for cheap. Just taking the coins at the moment. And yeah, that is what we're going to mark in matchups. Uh, I think this is going to be the end of the episode. If you did enjoy, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe if you're new, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.